Okay, uh, try natin ginawa ng ng uh, uh, the regular section dito <coughs> sa stab. Okay, so punta lang kayo dito. Uh, sa tools, then uh, create user table. Okay, so meron na akong nagawa dyan. Initially, yan. Uh, LB1 which is itong uh, columns dito sa corner so gawa tayo ng uh, bagong table so tulad ko lang yung table then uh, section type uh, check natin sa, sa general ok then click ok <coughs> so meron ka ng table to ngayon uh, so click mo lang to add new property and then, uh, lagay ko lang any logical name here, let's say PR 600 by 600 by 450, that's it. Okay, then check mo to, define polygon. Okay, ito yung, <coughs> so ito yung section na uh, i-add natin. Okay, so dapat alam mo yung mga coordinates ng corners. Okay, so... 0, 0 then going right 0.6 0 then ito 0.45 0 0.3 0 0.6 0 0.6 and 0 0.6 ok, okay na. then click mo lang complete section properties Yeah. So, yung coordinates mag adjust based doon sa uh, new CG noon section. Okay. So, <coughs> then ito yung mga calculated properties niya. Okay. Then, uh, click OK. Ayan. Pumasok na sa table 2 na yan. Okay. Then, uh, save table. Close. Then, i-apply natin yan dito sa, let's say, sa, uh, dito sa another corner. No? Ito yung una natin irregular uh, shape uh, section. No? So, itong uh, additional natin yan, irregular shape. So, yan. Click natin. Piece table. Then, okay. So, table 2. Complete. Click Add, and Close. And so, then we assign it here. Click Assign, and Yes. Yan. So, let's see how it will apply. So, that's the section we have. Okay. And okay. Then, we run the analysis. Okay, yan. So, yan mo mo diagram. Okay, so, wala tayong error. So, ganun lang ang pag-add ng uh, section. Uh, irregular, I mean, pag-add ng irregular uh, section. 